The Rough Riders started their five-game, four-day series against the Corpus Christi Hooks, needing to win four or five of the games to stay alive in the Texas League South Division race in the first half. They sent Reed Garrett to the mound, and Garrett gave up runs in the early going, giving up a single to Nick Tantalou in the first. Teoscar Hernandez to the plate in the second, and Hernandez hit a bomb to center field. This home run, one of two for Hernandez in the ball game, put the Hooks on top three to nothing. They scored another in the third before Hernandez got his next chance at the plate with a runner on in the fourth inning. And Hernandez would do it again, this time to left field, his second two-run home run of the ball game, his first two-homer game of the year, and sixth of his career, put the hooks on top by a six-to-nothing score. The Rough Riders, though, would rally, scoring three of the final four runs in the ball game. After a leadoff triple from Evan Van Hoosier in the fifth with one out, Luis Mendez at the plate. Hard liner by Mendez off the glove of the pitcher Martes. The hooks have no play on it, and the Rough Riders are on the board with their first run. Frisco left a man on it third in the sixth. It was in the seventh when they started scoring again against new pitcher Michael Freeman. Andy Abanez single to right field. That brings in Luis Mendez at 7 to 2. Next hitter, Ryan Cordell. He drops one down in left field, and uh, Cordell with his first hit of the night makes it 7-3, to three, and all of a sudden things are getting interesting. Ronald Guzman, though, would pop out to end the threat, ending the inning. It was 7-3 to the ninth with the Riders with one out. Get this single here from Chris Gurias, trying to stay alive, needing a, two more base runners to bring the tying run to the dish. With two outs, Andy Ibanez. Productive plate appearance for him. He draws the five-pitch walk. And that spells the end of the night for Michael Freeman. It was lifted for closer Aaron West. Ryan Cordell at the plate, needing to reach to bring the tying run to the plate. Cordell, a long battle ensuing, eight pitches. And finally, West wins out. He gets Cordell striking out, swinging on the high fastball. And the Riders leave the tying run on deck, falling in game one, seven to three. Their elimination number has dropped to one. The Hooks will capture the South Division Championship with a win in any of their six remaining games or loss from Frisco in any of the four games against the Hooks this week or either of the games in Midland to wrap up the first half on Sunday and Monday. The series continues on Thursday in a doubleheader at 5.05. Gates open at 4, and we hope to see you here at the ballpark. <laughs>